Hey, what's up guys? This is Corey Sloss, AKA Straight Sick from the G2 Halo team. And today we're gonna be making a tier list for all the Halos from one through infinite. Uh, first off, I gotta put Halo 4 in the... In the garbage spot. Facts, 100%. All right. Okay. For me, I right off the bat, Halo 4 didn't have D-scope. So I think, yeah. I think it was horrible, but that was just me. Yeah, the D scope I wasn't the biggest fan of the maps. Competitive skill wasn't there at its fullest, for sure. I, I don't like even think like half the teams like competed or like tried yeah. to like. I mean, yeah, that was definitely the season where Halo was on its like drop off. There was not much yeah. going on. I was playing other things and still competing, but it was definitely a lot of things about the game that just didn't feel the greatest. It wasn't Halo to me. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, it's gonna be the only one I'm gonna put in garbage as well. I think we could all agree on that. Yeah. What am I putting next? I mean... Put ODST I and Bad or Average. ODST? Bad. This was like more of the campaign, right? So, fight, Firefight? I would probably put this in... Yeah, I think bad? Just because it wasn't too much going on with it. Firefight was cool, but it didn't have too much competitive aspect into, into the game at all. So it was like... I, it wasn't for me, really. Yeah. yeah, I had no player versus player, which was something I really liked, too. So when I didn't yeah. have that, it was kind of just a drop off of the start. But campaign was good. Next, I'm going to put Halo Reach as average. I, th I think the beginning of the game really killed it. At, at the end of the game, they started to make it better, but it was already too late. So I'm going to have to put Halo Reach as average. What do you guys think? Halo Reach mm -hmm. is hard for me. Maybe yeah, maybe even good, but I, I think it's average. I might put Halo yeah, Reach in, in the good slot here, just because it did have a good season still across MLG when it was happening. I was obviously competing at that time, placing pretty well, so it was a lot of fun during that year for me, so I'm kind of biased, but I would definitely put it in the good, almost great category for me. All right, we can move it up to good. I agree with that. Even though it had the bloom and whatnot, it was still a really well-made team game. Halo 2. I don't really know much about Halo, Halo 2. Halo 2, I would put in exceptional. Yeah, exceptional. Nice to me. For me, it would put great, but yeah, for you guys. I don't really know much You guys played it more. It. You guys were more related to it. Me and Sad were. That's where, of, that's where Halo, it all 2 was, Halo 2 was the start of everything. Yeah. That was my childhood. Yeah, that's where it all started for me. I was so addicted to that game. My first tournament, yeah. I ended up going to MLG Anaheim 2006 and placed 21st in pro free for all out of a thousand heads. 2006? Yeah, crazy. and it was just like, I was 12. There was so much competition at the time, and I just went, met a bunch of pros that I've heard of, never seen before, through a friend who was already a pro in Halo 2. His name's George Frosty, old school Halo guy, not the new one. Yeah, he was freaking showing me around, man. He was showing me all these pros, and it was an awesome time, man. I put Halo 2 in the top just because that was my childhood, but it was also one of the best multiplayer games that I've played. So yep. I can definitely attest to that. I just put it in great instead of excellence because you guys, because I wasn't really able to, I guess, literally enjoy it to its full potential like you guys really were able to. I never got my, uh, my brothers only had one Xbox, so I literally probably got like one hour every three days. So I, I really wasn't able to enjoy it, but when I, it was my first game and definitely one of the most uh, fun games I ever played. The shields, recharging, everything, I don't know, it was just different from any other game. And on top of that, it was my first game I ever played, so I don't know. It was just a love I, I definitely have only for this game and no other game. And it's probably starting because of Halo 2. That's how I fell in love with it when I was like five years old. Halo 1, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that in as exceptional as well. I mean, you, you have to at this you point. Have it, to, man. it started everything. I didn't get to experience, experience it as much as everyone else just because I was super young at the time, but it, it was like, it was the first FPS I ever played. Land parties with like my brother and his friends and everything, and that's how the game became so popular. Yeah. We have to put it as exceptional. I would have to agree. I mean, that's system link, playing with my cousins, my family. That's how it all started for me too, you know? I mean, Halo was the, Halo 1 was the game, man. That was the game to play. You were playing that with your friends all the time after school or whatever. I wish I could relate, but I literally Yeah, was... I can't relate. <laughs> no, I, literally... I was trying not to say anything, but I mean... I was born is, when the game came out. It is tough if you can't no, relate. because I feel like we just can't put so many things in exceptional. So like... It's I mean, true, so but... Like, I, I feel like we're like way, you... too, way too, like, just nice. Like, Halo 2, I mean, I understand, but I don't know. I... Halo, Halo, Halo 1. 2 is the biggest game of all time. Yeah, yeah. That, that, was, that's that's fine. that was the first yeah, game for Xbox Live. I mean, you're right. What are you thinking? Like, I'll just say, I'll I'll say great. I, I, I'm, you say great? Yeah. I don't even say great. 
Really? You wouldn't put Halo 1 in great? I mean, I mean the game's like whatever, but like. <sighs> Did you ever play the campaign of Halo 1? It's just an old game. I don't that's know. Where I you guess were. maybe. That, that's where you don't know, bro. You gotta play that campaign. Uh, hmm. A full that's... playthrough of the campaign, at least. I mean, it was, a, it was fun while I was a little, like, kid playing it, but, um, I mean, I don't know. I mean, if uh, you guys want to put we, it... We, we can put it as great, because me and Corey say exceptional. Yeah. You two say good, True. so we'll, we'll put it as great. We could balance it out pretty right, great. Cool. You might get some flack for that from you yeah, guys, though, because... You, you might catch I, some strays. I mean, we could... So, I know somebody's We could change gonna, all this towards the end if we want to adjust anything. I'm going mean. to get Ogre 1 on me, Ogre 2 on me. I just haven't played it, dude. I was <laughs> I, I was born I was born before the... Or, I wasn't even a year old when the game came out. No, I, I understand. You. I was like a few months. I understand old when the why you guys out. wouldn't feel so. that way. It's just crazy because it's so okay. iconic. Next, I would probably throw Halo Three. I think I would give Halo Three a great. Great. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you guys will give Halo One exceptional, but not Halo Three an exception. Well, it's or just up there. Halo Three is exceptional on land. It wasn't the best online. I it, could agree with that. It on during the time the era that we played and competed in Halo Three before this like last you know Halo Three season, Halo Three was not the greatest game online. It was definitely hard to play and compete online. When you got to the tournament, it made the game almost almost borderline exceptional. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I see what you're saying. But I would give it great. Yeah, same. I enjoyed it as a social player, and it's just a. I got my first tournament win in Halo Three, so I would put exceptional, but we'll, we'll go with good. Great. They're great, sorry. I know. Okay, my turn. Okay, you you guys already know like yep. where this is going. Come on. H five. H five has to be an exceptional. Like, exceptional. Oh wow. Big facts. I'll put I'm, I'm putting it right there. Like, Best game right of there. all time. I mean, I just think I mean I'm just like a one of the new gen like type of players, so I mean I guess I'll I just put it there, but I, I gotta fail. Hill five is just is just so like there's just so much potential like to yeah. be unlocked and like just I just feel like anyone like any good player can like who's good at Halo 5 can just play like these other Halos yeah. like but any other FPS in general honestly yeah. too. It's just super just fast paced and just I, I just feel like it's just the most skillful like just, uh, compared to other Halos but I mean yeah. Okay I definitely I can agree I with those standpoints. It. I mean it was definitely the biggest game when it comes to money and prize pool so there was a lot of people playing. Uh, the skill gap in that game is insane so I see that for sure. Yeah. I feel um, like their mechanics weren't, it, it, it was a little early for their mechanics and everything, but... For sure. I think people I like didn't really want to adapt to what they had offered in that game, and that's why people don't put it in the exceptional category that they yeah, should. Yeah, I agree. Because it was a really good game, it just didn't seem like a Halo game. Yeah, especially towards the end, I know that. In the beginning, I, I would put it as like great, and then by the end, it, it was one of the best games. For sure. Yeah. Infinite's last one. I mean, I, I'm just going to... I mean, just playing the flight and everything, I gotta, I mean, I'll just say exceptional. Like, I don't know what you guys think. Is I, think I think Infinite is gonna be the best game. Yep. Oh, yeah. I'm sure. not even kidding. I've played all the Halos growing up. As far as the the mechanics, the way that the game felt, Balance. even even being in the beta, knowing that it was the beta and not the completed game, everything felt like what I was looking for in a new Halo. Even with the new weapons and everything, you know, I felt yeah. like it was it was clean. It felt nice, and I'm I'm excited, dude. I think Halo's gonna be really Halo yeah. Infinite's gonna be really good. They balanced it for all new players to come into, so it'll definitely be something like we've never experienced too. True. So I feel like this will definitely, honestly, be better than. It's um, gonna honestly top like of list, no, it could honestly like be more skillful than like H5, like just like definitely. right off the bat, just the yeah. way the way we have to aim. Equipment, the aiming. Having uh, the bots, like I haven't grinded by myself for hours on end like that since true. Halo 2. Like yeah. I literally grinded bots for like 10 hours at a time. Yeah, I'm never learning had every a little faster of the a game. Shooting a practice weapon drill system. Like yeah, there's so many things in this game that are gonna be way beyond these other Halos. I feel like, and it's hard to say so early, but from what we've already seen, it's it looks potential. like it's gonna be yeah. amazing for sure. That's way too much of potential. Yeah. I think put, it's definitely... Put that before Halo 5, please. <laughs> please. Oh, I think it's definitely uh, gonna be an exceptional one, for I mean, sure. do we wanna adjust anything, or is this looking like I think it? this looks good. All right, so we're going with, for exceptional, we got Halo 5, Halo Infinite, Halo 2. For great, we got Halo 3 and Halo 1. For good, we're going with Halo Reach. And then for bad, we got Halo ODST, and garbage, we're sitting at Halo 4. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. I think this is a good list. I think it looks solid. Yep. It's pretty solid. 
Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the G2 Halo team making this tier list for all the Halos. If you guys have any disagreements or you agree with any of what we've said, let us know in the comments. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. Hmm. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. I'm just trying to say it correctly. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video that the G2 Halo team made. No. Well, let's just cut. We got it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we're going to reposition Bro. the next...